So here we have some missing number additions. Now we know that we can find missing numbers using the inverse operation. But rather than using column subtraction here, let's see if we can solve these mentally. So for this first question, the last four digits are the same. So we can circle the digits that have changed and work out how they have changed. So, ignoring the last four digits, how can you get 154 from 55? You add 99. So our answer is 990,000 because we have 99 followed by four zeros because the final four digits stayed the same in our answer. Now for this next question, we can highlight the digits that have changed. So how do you get 72 from 64? You add 8. So because the final four digits are the same in our answer, we need an 8 followed by four zeros. So that's 80,000. So now pause the video and see if you can find the missing number for this last question. So let's highlight the digits that have changed. To get 15 from 9, you need to add 6. And because the last three digits haven't changed, we need a 6 followed by three zeros. So that's 6,000.